I invited both candidates to come on the show, arguing that health had become a big part of this campaign cycle, both their personal health and the nation's health. Secretary Clinton is still considering our invitation. Mr. Trump confirmed last week, uh, never asked any uh, uh, requests around the questions I was going to ask, didn't put any limitations on what I asked, and then he pulled out this document. I did not know I was going to get it before the show. I'd heard reports to the opposite. We had had very limited conversations uh, because they hadn't asked much of us, and I was gl uh, gratified to see the document when I obtained it and read through it, which I did on the show. So you didn't have a, a look at these before the show? Nope, hadn't seen them. Well, had you had the opportunity to sort of review them at length, would you have asked them anything different? The document was well-crafted. It was put on the letterhead of a physician at a hospital in New York City, Lenox Hill Hospital, uh, signed by that physician. So uh, it's pretty standard that we'd review it in short form. And uh, there weren't any big glaring issues either, which made it a bit easier to digest. Were you surprised that uh, Donald Trump took you up on your offer? I was. I, would, I was hoping that to get those documents. We had asked, but I hadn't gotten any closure on that. And as I mentioned, there wasn't a lot of conversation going back except the acceptance of the invitation. Uh, so I was gratified. I, I, I think that he realized, and to address an issue you brought up earlier, I'm a doctor. I host uh, a widely viewed health show. By, uh, in, the viewers are people interested in health. I mean, why not have me help interpret the document? It seems as logical as just putting it out in the press release.